Oxford Discover, Student Book 5, by Kenna Burke. Published and copyrighted by Oxford University Press. Page 72. Read. Magdi and the Dolphin. Magdi looked out of the window and saw clear blue skies. Yes, he shouted. It's a beautiful day. I can go fishing. Hi, Dad. Bye, Dad. It's a beautiful day. See you later, shouted Magdi. He was so excited that he was speaking very, very fast. He rushed out of the house with his fishing rod. What did he say? asked his sister. He said that it was a beautiful day for fishing, chuckled Magdi's dad with a big smile on his face. He's always happy when he goes fishing. Magdi raced to the beach and untied his little red fishing boat. Maybe today I'll catch a fish for dinner, he thought. He waded out into the warm blue water, pushing the boat until it floated. Then he jumped into it and paddled towards some rocks. Magdi looked over the side of the boat and saw a lionfish. He knew that lionfish were very dangerous. They could sting you. Magdi sat and watched quietly as it dove under the boat and disappeared under a rock. Next, he saw a parrotfish with its shiny blue, purple, and green scales gliding through the water. Parrotfish are tasty, he thought. Maybe today I'll catch a parrotfish. Magdi put a piece of bread on the hook of his fishing rod and threw the fishing line into the water. Then he threw more bread into the water to attract the fish. Suddenly, hundreds of fish swam up to the boat. There were bright yellow fish, black and white fish that looked like zebras, fish with long noses, and big, fat pufferfish. Magdi knew all their names. He beamed with delight. Maybe I won't catch any fish today, he thought. They're beautiful. Maybe today I'll just watch them. Magdi pulled his paddles into the boat turned onto his stomach to watch the fish, and fell asleep in the warm sun. Magdi woke up feeling chilly. Looking up, he saw black skies. Big waves were shaking his little red fishing boat, and it was drifting out to sea. Two of Magdi's friends, Malik and Ali, were playing on the beach. Hey, Magdi! Magdi, they shouted. Come back! There's a storm! Their words floated across the water, carried by the wind. What did you say? Magdi yelled. We said that there was a storm, shouted Malik and Ali. Come back! Uh-oh, thought Magdi. He tried to paddle towards the beach, but the waves pushed him further away. A huge wave crashed onto his boat, throwing him into the water. Oh no, help! Help! Magdi cried. But just at that moment, he felt something under the water, a very big something. Then, to his surprise, he was moving through the waves at high speed, heading straight for the beach. He looked down and saw a beautiful grinning face. It was a dolphin. The dolphin splashed and jumped through the water, carrying Magdi on its back. The dolphin used its powerful tail to propel its body through the water. When they got to the shallow water, the dolphin dropped Magdi on the sand and then swam up and down in front of him. Thank you, my friend, whispered Magdi. Every day afterward, Magdi and the dolphin played in the ocean. The dolphin taught Magdi tricks, such as how to dive deep down to the ocean floor, how to float, how to glide through the water, and how to stay away from a storm.